Look, my office was called about 6.30 this morning by the Lexington and Fayette Urban County Fire Department. We've responded to Tate's Creek Road and Par Parliament, which is out past New Circle, between uh, New Circle and Man of War. Uh, we have a four vehicle collision. Um, from what I understand, uh, a Mitsubishi was traveling outbound, we believe at a high rate of speed, uh, swerved to miss an S10 pickup truck that was turning from Palama, or, uh, Parliament uh, inbound on Tate's Creek Road. Um, at that point, uh, the Mitsubishi clipped an inbound Mercedes and then was T-boned by a Chrysler that was also traveling inbound. Um, we have two drivers from two different vehicles, obviously, that has been transported. Uh, I'm not sure about their conditions. We have one dead white male uh, who was a passenger in the Mitsubishi. Um, at this point, um, the only thing that I can see that might be a contributing factor is just the fact of, from what I understand and statements, that um, this was the inbound Mitsubishi, which as the passenger that died, uh, was traveling at a high rate of speed. I don't see any alcohol, I don't see any evidence of any type of drug, paraphernalia, anything of that nature. So um, at this point, what we'll do is we will transport uh, this gentleman to our office. Uh, I'll take the um, body fluids, blood, urine, uh, and do a toxicology test um, in order to find out the cause of death um, or if there was uh, any type of illicit drugs or alcohol. Um, at this point, looking at the, uh, the deceased, it appears that he uh, died from just a blunt impact. Uh, there's not that much as far as external injuries to him, so obviously there must be uh, quite a bit of internal, and there was a, a pretty good void in the Mitsubishi car. Questions? How was the uh, driver of the Mitsubishi? Um, again, I don't know. Yeah, he, the driver of the Mitsubishi was transported, and the driver of the Chrysler was transported. Uh, the Mercedes um, is, and the S10 both are giving statements to the police officer about uh, the investigation. Seatbelts and all that you know of? I ask about my passenger who has died and uh, at this point he was not wearing a seatbelt. There, no, there was no belt on him. The officer actually uh, reached in in order to take his pulse and wasn't and there was no belt and was able to get his arm and, and didn't find the pulse. It's such a sad thing, you know, we wake up and go work on every Tuesday morning and we just think, you know, never get any points. And these, the, you know, the, the my deceased person appears to be exactly doing that, uh, traveling to work, looked to be, uh, you know, a pretty hard worker, um, again, traveling to work and you know, I'd rather be a little bit late than to not be there at all. But obviously, uh, our accident reconstruction folks will be here for a while. So when you all are out telling people, you need to let people know that they need to avoid this area of Tate's Creek at Parl uh, Parliament, Parliament, excuse me, uh, and that's close to Cheddar's. Everybody knows where Cheddar's is. Do you know at all the relation to who the driver was? No, I don't. I don't even know who those people are. And, who our people are here right now. I just wanted to get you all so that you could get this out and let people know that traffic's being uh, diverted.